Hello and welcome to the video tutorial for Tomb Racer. In this video we're going to be looking at how to reskin the levels. Now within Tomb Racer there's three levels available. Um, there's Environment 1 which represents Level 1, uh, Level 2 which is Environment 2 and Level 3 which is Environment 3 which is you can see now. Okay, in this reskin we're going to focus on Environment 1 which is located here. Now, within each level, they are broken down into patches. Um, now, Environment 1 has six patches. Um, it's important to remember that when you edit and you put your own prefabs in, it's to make sure that they go into the correct patch. Now, for example, patch 1 is this beginning section here. If I was to place any um, houses or anything within the first part, I'd make sure it's in patch 1. The second patch, um, which is located here, as you can see, I can slide it out, and that better represents where the patch begins and end. So for this demonstration, I'm just going to show you patch 0. Um, we're going to uh, delete all the objects within patch 0 uh, and place new objects in um, to show you the basics of reskinning the level. So I'm now going to go ahead and delete all of the objects within patch 0 besides the road. I'm now going to um, speed up the time um, and just lay a few objects, place them into the patch zero, um, and then you'll see how simple it is to complete the level. Okay, so it's important to emphasize that this is just for demonstration purposes. Um, within your own game, you'd want to take a lot more care um, to make sure everything's a lot more precise um, than what I'm doing right now. So now you have your prefab in place, um, as I mentioned earlier, it's very important to make sure that this is in the correct patch, in this case it will be patch 0. Once the level starts repeating itself, uh, the game object will be present.